Alright, what's up guys? Welcome to another Is It Worth Buying video, and in today's video, you know, I know a lot of you guys are gonna probably be all like, fam, T-Moss boss. How is it that you have talked crap about Ubisoft all this time, and the one time, the one time where we probably thought, like, you ain't gonna like this game, you probably ain't gonna play it, you ain't gonna want nothing to do with it, the Crew Motorfest, that game is actually solid. Like, if there is any game that Ubisoft has done right in the past, like, few years, Ghost Recon Wildlands was solid. The First Division was solid. But, no, nah, the Crew Motherfest, that, that was actually pretty solid. Like, no, nah, I've been uh, playing the trial of it. I haven't bought the full game because I'm still not ready to make that commitment yet. But, um, no, nah, man, it's actually pretty good. You know, it, it does remind me of Forza Horizon. It has, like, its elements of Forza Horizon. But it plays so much more smoother than Forza Horizon. Like, I have a steering wheel controller. And when playing, um, uh, this uh, Forza Horizon 5 with the steering wheel controller, it feels so off. Like, I'm having to, you know that scene in the Polar Express when they were trying to, like, steer the train and it was on the ice and it kept, like, sliding? That's exactly how I feel when I play Forza Horizon 5 with the steering wheel. And I don't know, maybe it's because it's a Logitech uh, G923. I don't know if that would have anything to do with it or maybe I'm just a bad driver. But it's like, fam, I've played... Grid Legends, no problem with the steering wheel controller. I played a set of cords of competition, no problem with the steering wheel controller. I'm trying to think. Dirt Rally, I have to say Dirt Rally is one of those games, it's kind of like a set of cords of competition where you just got to learn how to play it, but I felt like that it was solid with a steering wheel controller. Forza Horizon 5 was the only game where I'm like, I'm having to like turn like this and then have the turn. <laughs> like, it's just too much, man. But no, with the steering wheel controller and the crew, um, Motherfest, it's good. But other than that, like, racing is solid. Um, the scenery is freaking amazing. I was like, comparing it to uh, Forza Horizon 5, I was like, nah, man, the scenery is pretty nice. I do like it a lot. Um, so yeah, everything about the game is pretty solid, and it comes off as a game where it's like, you're able to, you're gonna be playing a lot of it, it ain't gonna be like, okay, like, you beat it, and then it's just that one time beating it, and you know, you're done, and you moved on, no, it comes off as a game where it's like, you're, you're good, because I'm just going based off of, like, the division for an example you know how like i play even after beating that game i still was playing it and going back and doing missions so they probably i feel that uh the crew mother fest is probably something along those lines too where it's just you're continuously playing it and stuff so but nah man it's a solid game you know like it, it's not one of those games where it's like because comparing it to the crew too i felt i didn't really like the racing in there because i didn't like the fact where it's like i could upgrade my car find all these different parts and and my thing is this i'll have like a struggle with the race because maybe i'm too close of the level that they recommend but even if i'm like way above average of the level that they're recommending i'm still having an issue beating the cars versus in here it's like no they have it where it's uh i think there's a difficulty settings and i put it on easy and i'm like fam it, it's a breeze getting through those races and stuff so yeah i was like i don't like when games do that i don't like when games where it's like fam like either have it where it's if it's on like some difficult stuff then it's like okay say that but yeah, with the Crew Mother Fest, it, it ain't even about that. Like, I, I guess, like, you do put on a harder difficulty, then, yeah, the race is gonna probably be a little bit harder. But other than that, man, no, nah, I'm, I'm having, I'm actually having a good time playing the game. Like, if anybody were to ask me, because I was just recommending it to a friend of mine, because he was looking at some new games to play, and I was like, fam, play the Crew Mother Fest. I was like, it's actually, you know, because I, I don't think he's played any of the other Crew games. He might have played one, but I don't know if he ever did play two, but the uh motor fest it's actually pretty good i was like nah you guys can you know hold off like more so just to have it where it's like just adding more and more content to this crew but um no it's like you guys can hold off but more so just i i felt like a lot of you know work had overall been done to this game compared to the last one because the last one i i felt that it didn't you know like they tried to do things to it but yeah it was like it's 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 not really gaining people's attention so no nah, but with this one though like it, it's it's good i do like it i will overall recommend it to people in case if you guys are looking for a new game to play but anyways other than that i will talk to you guys later thank you guys for watching like and let me know in the comment sections how you feel about the game do you like it do you hate it but anyways thank you guys for watching like subscribe if you're new to the channel and peace